Shalom. First and foremost, I would like to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Harakakwadash. I would also like to give a double honor unto my apostles of Great Millstone that have taught me this truth, and I would like to say a sincere Shalom unto the hopeful elect that are scattered throughout the four winds of the world, unto the servants, the prophets, the men that are prophesying and laboring in this truth and in this doctrine. Unto you, I say Shalom. Um, it's going to be a quick lesson. I just want to go into a, make a response, you know, just show you the simplicity of our people right now, all right? These niggas out here are trying to build in America, all right, trying to have businesses while the Most High is tearing this place down, all right? And these brothers out here were prophesying on this Tuesday, today, the you know, August 16th, and this nigga comes up and, and starts talking about economics and businesses and the most high is tearing this place down. Hey, you got droughts, you got famine, you got all types of form of pestilence, you got uh, a division amongst a nation. The most high is, is is literally breaking America down. But what are our people trying to do? What are our people's main concentration? It ain't on salvation. It ain't uh, how I can be saved from uh, this peril that's coming. It's we need to have businesses and black restaurants. I'm gonna play the video where this you know where this where this, this nigga man he, he comes up. The brother and the brothers out there trying to trying to give you the warning, all right, trying to feed you with knowledge and wisdom from the highest, from from your how about Shemiah Shai, the heavenly Father and His Son, okay, to give you a, a, a stern warning of what's come is what's coming to pass. But our, what, where are the mind of our people? Where are the mind of you, so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, still here in America, all right, uh, uh, still trying to to make it here, still trying to have business and, and be established in. And, 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 and have longevity and prosper here in Babylon. This place is going up in flames, okay, literally, all right? And, and, it's, going to, and it's going to be broken down. It's being broken down by Yahweh by Shema all right, uh, spiritually, spiritually right now, uh, through his prophets that, that are spiritually chanting this place down, all right? Uh, these brothers usually go out on, on, on Fridays, but they're out on a Tuesday, okay, to show you that, that, that you know, Hey, the, 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 the truth is, get, is getting out there, all right? So it's no excuse for any of you Jakes out there. Just like this Jake that just got, came up to the camp, he gonna, he, he's going to remember the time when he came amongst the prophets and the, and the spirit that he was in, all right? So you Israelites out there, y'all should know what time it is, all right? You, you Israelites the, uh, that, that are fortunate enough to have eyes to see this truth and this knowledge and, and, what's, to, uh, and what's to come to this place, all right, that have a, a shot at salvation. Hey, you understand that this is not our rest. Okay, so let me play this real quick. I got a few precepts I'm going to bring out. And uh, Lord willing, this lesson is edifying unto the elect. You got to talk to the government about that. No, no, but you know what I'm saying? Like, like this guy, we need somebody to really talk to them and yeah. encourage them. Well, we, we say, you know, you know what I'm thinking about doing, though? I mean, scriptures is good, reading the Bible and so forth. Not the right way. Coming back to the fact that you're an Israelite, right. not not church uh, Christianity. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and, and our people don't want to hear that. Our people don't want to hear about uh, the the goodness and uh, that the Lord has got coming to us. All right, that this 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 man system, this oppressive system, is coming to an end. Our people don't want to hear that. Our people want to know how we can thrive here and how we can build here in America. Hey, and even Israelites, even Jakes that know the Israelites, they're still trying to build here. All right. Hey, of course, we have to live in this society, this wicked society. We have to try to make ends meet. All right. And like the elder Yasharamba said, if you have a business, you know, you know, if that that is if that's what supports you and your family, so be it. But we're not trying to build here. All right. Hey, you just pray to the Lord for your daily bread, pray for food and raiment, a, a roof over your head, clothes on your back. OK. And, and pray for the Lord to get you to the next day. OK. Get you through the next uh could you do the next day, the next hour, the next minute, this next, the next second? All right, we're not praying that America is here for 10 years, 20 years, for, for, for you know, 30, 40, 50 years, 100 years, where we can have great-grandchildren and all that shit. All right, this is not our rest. This is not our, our, our this is a captivity. This is a, this is a, this was a, a punishment for the children of Israel. All right, I'll play the rest of it. That, don't work. that has really helped our people to get into that condition. But life, but life is about economics. Right. It ain't even about... Well, where's the economics going? Oh, let me ask you this. Would uh -huh. you put a, in order to forward that plan or your business and everything that you're doing on Earth, would you put a, a chip inside of you? No. Oh, definitely no. Oh, no. Yeah, oh, no. This nigga's lying. He don't know what he would do in that situation. That's why it's called the hour of temptation. 
which is going to try the world. All right, so a guy like this, a Jake like this, okay, so-called Negro, Latino, Native American that has got a business, got a restaurant, or whatever it may be, and has it built up uh, uh, unto a, a, a un, you know, where they're successful, they're able to, you know, buy things that they want and, and do what they want and stuff. Okay, are they going to be willing to, you know, put that aside, give up that business, give up that wealth or uh, 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 the prosperity that their hard work to not take that that CHIP? A lot of them, a lot of them are going to give in, all right? Because he says no now, but if your faith is not built up, if you're not calling on the proper names of your Yahweh Shema Shai, and the Lord is not dealing with you and put that spirit on you to deny your flesh and deny everything in this world but the Lord, you're going to give in, all right? Just like this nigga right here is talking that talking that shit now, but the scripture says they uh, they do honor me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. This nigga's not thinking about the Lord. All right, either it's two thirds of our people. I'm just saying, so anything like, you plan on doing, eventually you gonna have to deal with that. Yeah. Anything well, you plan on doing, you gonna have to ultimately bow to a particular system. Right now. <laughs> well, you you talk about you talk no, about no. you talk about we, we talking we we going into how uh -huh. Biden is passing legislation to bring forth that system now a caste society. Jake, uh -huh. Jake has no so Jake we, has no clue what the hell is going on. Okay, these devils are passing. Laws and legislations, executive orders, left and right. All right, doing shit under the table. All right, to take away more of your rights and to gain more control. All right, but our people have no clue what the hell is going on. Our people don't know what's going on in, uh, geopolitically. Our people uh, don't know what's going on in uh, uh, with the war in Russia and you Ukraine and and China. They have no clue. Okay, but hey, this, these 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 calamities are going to come upon them unawares. All right, it's going to come like a thief in the night. So like you. But for right now, but for right now, we need leaders. We need leaders like all of us to kind of minister to the guys. We're giving them free free water, but they ain't listening. Jake don't want to hear that. They don't want to hear that. What's the free water? The word. This is what washes the mind. Not yeah, but sometimes we may get the people chicken and bring them some 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 lamb neck bones and stuff like that. Jake gonna go back to economics. Jake gonna go back to economics. Jake gonna go back to economics. They'll just be up here to get the neck bone. Right, that's true. That but is after true. You, after, after that's they, true. You know, that's true. Be going that's back, true. You know but I'm just saying, just a little, a little bit of encouragement. Like I just walked by this guy. He had his head down. Right. I say, what did I say? I say things gonna get better. You know, just, just it's not gonna get better though. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be honest. With him. <laughs> Jake don't, Jake don't want that. Molested all over the planet Earth. It's too far gone for us to try to fix it carnally. We got to change spiritually as a people. We got to get our spirit right. That's true. That's and you're true. an Israelite. And but it's about black, economics too. Also, right. the true economics, I don't see any black restaurants. I don't okay. see any black restaurants. Right. Are These you, niggas bugged out, man. Our, our people are. I, I'm gonna get the scripture. Hosea, Hosea five, uh, four and four and six. This, this is this is the this is the the mind state of our people right now. They don't see an end. They don't see an end. They don't see and they don't want to see an end to America. All right. This is the book of Hosea chapter four and verse six for my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge because thou hast rejected knowledge and knowledge is staring them right, staring that Jake right in the face, but he's rejecting it. Okay. Thou hast rejected knowledge. I also reject thee that thou shalt be no priest to me. Seeing thou hast forgotten the law of thy power. I also will forget thy children. The Lord is Lord is not is, is going to forget you niggas. Lord, once the elect is sealed, the hundred and forty four thousand, the uh, okay, and the one third, the Lord is turning his back on you niggas, man, because you turn your back on the Lord. All right, the Lord is, is got his prophets out there. All right, that that are that are prophesying and laboring and, and telling you, Jakes, to get right, giving you the word, giving you the healing. We are right, giving you the the wisdom of the scriptures. All right, giving you the keys to salvation. And what do our people do? They worried about economics. They work it worried about folly and bullshit. Like I said, these, these niggas is not, they're not seeing, they don't see an end to Esau's kingdom. This is uh the book of Ezekiel chapter 12 and uh verse uh Yeah shit. Let me start at uh 25. For I am the Lord, I will I will speak. And the word that I shall speak shall come to pass. And the, the words that the Lord has spoken and speaking are the words of the prophets through, through his spirit. All right. The, the, these mysteries, 
these uh, uh, these hard sayings that the uh, Lord has put the spirit on the apostles, the elders to break down and we're feeding you and we're feeding the people. OK, but hey, the Lord is making his words come to pass and it shall no more be pro no more prolonged for in your days. O rebellious house. Will I say the word and will perform it? Say the Lord power. The Lord is going to perform every every prophecy in this book from the destruction of America to the MOTB to the famine to the uh, 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 men travailing like women. OK, it's for, for for to the uh, uh, the women being ravished. All right, kids being you know killed and you know the the you know women being killed and you know murdered and all these things are going to come to pass. The Lord is not just speaking to just speak. All right, it's prophecies in this book that still have to come to pass, and lo and behold, they will come to pass. All right, verse twenty six. And again, the word of the Lord came to me, saying, "Son of man, behold, they of the house of Israel, Israelites, so called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans. All right, and Israelites scattered amongst these heathens." Israelites, Israel say, the vision that he seeth is for many days to come, and he prophesieth of the times that are far off. That's what this Jake thinks. This Jake thinks that, you know, okay, yeah, the Bible is good, but what about economics? He this nigga's thinking about money. Okay, this this that's what that's where Jake's mind is at right now. Money, getting the bag. Okay. These they think that these times, these prophetic times that we're living in, that we're currently living in, prophes you know, pro yes, yes. Uh, a prophecy, a famine, pestilence, uh, a world world war, nation rising against nation, race wars, economic turmoil. That why if this nigga's all in the economics, why isn't he looking at the dollar? Why isn't he looking at uh, how everything is going digital? The the, the uh, um you know the the um you know gas prices and everything that has to really deal with economics of this place. It's it's, it's all going down. It's all going downhill. Why is this nigga not speaking of uh um Inflation and hyperinflation, because Jake really don't got the knowledge. Jake has the knowledge of this world, which is not, which is, which is foolishness. All right, verse twenty-eight. Therefore, say unto them, Thus saith the Lord, There shall no, there shall none of my words be prolonged any more. But the word which I have spoken shall be done, saith the Lord. Power. The Lord's words are coming to pass. They're going to come to pass. Okay, this is Habakkuk chapter two. Excuse, excuse me. Two and three for the vision is yet for an appointed time, but at the end it shall speak and not lie. Though it tarry, wait for it because it will surely come and and it will not tarry. The, hey, the Lord's word is coming to pass. All right. So why are all of you Jake's just sitting back there thinking that, you know, uh, these things aren't happening and, and you got your mind on something else? What's going to happen? The Lord, hey, the Lord's going to come upon you like a thief in the night. All right. Right when you right when you thinking. You know, you about to get this and this about to work out for you. Hey, the Lord is uh, uh, is going to bring his wrath amongst his people. All right. First and foremost, this is first Thess Thessalonians five and one. But of the times and the seasons, brethren, ye have no need that I write unto you. All right. Those true believers, you know, are going to know what time it is. All right. Are going to are the true believers, and the true worship worshipers of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh are going to understand the times that we're living in. All right, are not are, are and are not going to be focused on anything else but this truth. But everyone else is going to be focused on trying to build back America, trying to, uh, uh, uh um, yeah, build back America. H how you can maintain in America? All right, how how this how how can you survive during this digital this 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 digital system which they're breaking? All right, Jake is going to try to figure out any type of way to try to keep America afloat. And really, it's the two thirds that are really keeping America afloat right now. All right, because it's Edomites that want to see this place burn. All right, <laughs> that 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 are fed up with Esau. All right, are fed up with this tyrannical government. Okay, it's you niggas that 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 want to keep this place of, that that are that want to and are keeping this place afloat. All right, verse two, for yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night. For when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction cometh upon them. As travail upon a woman with child, and they shall not escape. You niggas ain't going to escape, all right? Because the devil is going to tell you, is, is going to put you in that mind state of peace and safety. That, you know, everything is back to how it was. No more lockdowns, all right? We just have to convert to this uh, uh, this new digital system and, you know, my, my, my business, my, uh, you know, all my, 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 my crypto or whatever type of business you niggas is into right now is, is going to continue to flourish, but the Lord got another thing coming because when the Lord comes like a thief in the night, it's going to be too late. 
It's going to be too late to find the prophets. It's going to be too late to try to seek the prophets and seek the word and seek what those brothers were talking about. Because the elect, those brothers that are prophesying and laboring in this truth, all right, that, that are, you know, chanting this place down are, are going to be in a safe place waiting on the Lord. All right. But verse four, but ye brethren are not in darkness that the day should not overtake you as a thief. And those brethren, all right, are, are the elect that, 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 are, that have eyes to see. And understand the times that we're living in and understand the prophecies. Ye are the children of light and the children of the day. We are we are not of the night nor of darkness. The children of light have the, the light is his wisdom. All right. Therefore, let us not sleep as others, as do others, but let us watch and be sober. All right. Hey, this nigga's asleep, man. They they didn't, you know, this Jake is is asleep. All right. This nigga is basically a walking zombie walking around Dallas. All right, talking about economics. All right, but hey, that's the Lord poured the, the spirit of deep sleep on these niggas. This is um, Isaiah 29 and um, 10. For the Lord have poured out upon you the spirit of deep sleep and have closed your eyes, the prophets and the, your rulers, the seers, hath he covered. So really, this it was an angel, all right, <coughs> hovering, you know, in the mist. That was blocking this nigga from getting any understanding. All right. The brothers try to, you know, this is the water. What water? And, and the angel, you know, before a, a, a righteous thought would come in this nigga's head, the angel blocked that shit. You know, tumbled that shit. Get out of here. No, you, this nigga, this nigga's not worthy uh, uh, of, of this truth. All right. But he had to come up there. So, you know, it wouldn't be an excuse that he'd ever knew. Okay. Because these plagues are coming. All right. And, and no one's going to turn them back. Or right, let me grab this real quick. This is the last scripture I want to get. You know, speaking of the plagues, because Jake don't see the plagues. Jake don't see the, the these plagues coming. This is uh second uh yeah, second Ezra chapter sixteen and three. A sword is sent upon you, and who may turn it back? A fire is sent among you, and who may quench it? Plagues are sent unto you, and what is he that may drive them away? May any man drive away a hungry lion in the wood or May anyone quench the fire and stubble when it has begun to burn. May one turn again the arrow that is shot from a strong archer. The mighty Lord sendeth plagues. And who is he that can drive them away? The Lord has sent the plagues. The plagues are out. Okay? The plagues of famine. The plagues of, the plagues of pestilence. The plague of economic turmoil. All right? That is sent out. All right? The Lord is not turning it around for, 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 for no niggas speaking on economics, trying to have a restaurant, or nobody. OK, the Lord's will is going to come to pass and it's coming to pass very swiftly. All right. And if you Jake's don't begin to wake up, you you know, and, and, and come up out of that deep sleep, you're going to hey, you're going to be judged out here. All right. You, you know, and you may get that ultimate judgment if you are if you take that MOTB. All right. So Lord willing, this lesson was edifying unto the elect. And I would like to give all praise, glory and honor unto you. How about Shimmy? How was shy? Until next time, I say Shalom.